everybody, my name is Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. In last episode, we um, tackled the first main boss of the game, and we made it to the uh, first uh, level, kind of. Hi. Oh, we don't even really talk to him. All right, enter the memory layer. Huh? Wait a minute, that's not a TV remote. Why is there a barber shop here? We. <laughs> Whoa, he looked very satisfied there. And very confused. So, yeah, apparently the Mermelayer entrance is in a retirement home? I, I don't know why, but was it always in a retirement home? What what, if, what what about when they were younger? Anyways, the Mermelayer, which also houses one of the, the game's first very big scary challenge, and I'm excited to tackle it to see if I still have issues with it or not, because I don't think I will, if I'm being honest. Well, <laughs> I shouldn't say that, but... Opening presents. Same. Look at my five underwear. <laughs> Good animation. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. You shouldn't sneak up on Mermaid Man like that. His heart's not so good. Come to think of it, nothing on him is that good anymore. Sorry, Mermaid Man. It's just that I'm always so excited to see you two. Standing in your awesome presence gives me the chills of justice. See? I've got goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps on my... All right, kid. Knock it off. Just tell us what you want. Well, I really want a new pair of sunglasses. Patrick sat on my old ones. That's not what I meant. <sighs> Actually, it's a good thing you showed up, young sponge of goodness. <laughs> it is? It is? Yes. A bunch of evil robots have taken over the Mermelair security system. No! It's up to you to shut it down and stop them! But why him? We're perfectly capable superheroes. Because it's Thursday, and we have a whole bunch of doctor's appointments. Ironically, I'm pretty sure this episode will be uploaded on Thursday. <laughs> ah, fish sticks. I forgot. Is that ironic? Go talk to the Mermelair computer in the next room. I accept Oops. this awesome responsibility, Mermaid Wait, Man. You won't be disappointed. Why is he holding his bubble wand? But not disappointed. Huh? Cool glitch. To the doctor's office. Away. <laughs> I love that animation for Mermaid Man. So there's been a very massive bug I've been seeing all over Twitter with this game where apparently these guys either get absolutely fucking massive, like the entire level large, or they get like incredibly small. I don't know sponge, what caused it. Uh, we'll see if it naturally happens, I guess. Like um, but it's Pretty. funny and silly Can't and a billy. Uh, okay, I guess that's how I'm supposed to get down here. So let's start using our bubble. Whoa! Can I hit that? Oh no! Th th these, this feels weird, dude. Um. Hmm. I don't really know if I like the sponge bowl in this game. Oh, it despawns. Dang it. Oh, there we go. So this level is kind of a tutorial for the sponge bowl, really. It, it like, you get to used to all the controls. Ah, oh, bro. Whoa. Interesting. Go, go, go. Yes. Oh, he looks good in this game. I like how he's like kind of crouched over. It had more of like an upright position originally. Although, he's a bit more lively. <gasps> they got rid of his gun? I think he had a gun or something before. Hmm. Guess I'm not. I guess I wouldn't, shouldn't be too surprised. He still has a weird teleporting animation. I never got like, I don't know why he can fly, but he can fly using his hat. I, I, I don't get it, but um, yeah, he can fly using his hat. Look at that. I don't, huh? Why? Who gave you permission to fly? There's a no-fly air zone. Okay. Oh, he gives you a lot of money. If he got, he gave me fifty plus there. Um, how do I get access to that? Oh God. Oh God. Oh, it's this. I see. Uh, I could go over there though. I think I want to go over there next. So. Oh no. Oh no, has it this side? Oh god. Alright, this is still as weird a feeling as it was originally. 
The bubble wall things feel very strange. At least these, these switches. What a very specific thing for you guys to have, Merman Man, Bunker Boy. I don't know why you crouch sometimes. I didn't touch any buttons there. I, I was pushing the control stick the full way. Oh, it's a sock. I thought it was a spatula. It's a little bit er er early to get spatulas, though. In, 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 in. You know what? I don't really like that you walk forward. A lot of, like, journalists were get getting shit because they were complaining of the fact you walk forward. But I kind of agree a little bit. I think it's a little lame that you walk forward with with, with um, the sponge blow. I, it's just, I don't like it, man. All right. Oh, you can't even... Come on. Oh, you can't even... Wait, really? Uh-uh. This is wrong. Oh, my God. They fucked up so much. The entire point of the invisible is you can sit on it and drive on it when it's invisible. And instead of in the original game, you could actually stand on it even if you don't click the switch. In this game, they load it in, then deload it. It's so lazy. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, I hate it! It's so lazy! Also, you can't like step like in, so it's just one flat texture. Morning. Smells like victory. I'm sorry to complain this much about something, but it's like this game was not made with love. This the original game was made with love. This game was made with hatred. No, it was made for like money. They saw money and they went for it. That's what it feels like to me. And they are making promises to fix it, so I think there is some care in this like game. Did we get the original one? Okay, it, if you don't find the original one, it tells you that you can open up the other one first, but... I don't think they completely just did this for money, to be fair, because, you know, they are posting on Twitter, they're, they're committing to, like, fixing stuff, but... Like, come on, man. <sighs> they polish some things, and they make some other things terrible. The Mermelair. Secret Fortress of the Wrinkly Superheroes, Mermaid Man, and Barnacle Boy. Oh, yeah. They made my Squidward, deal. am I happy to see you? And not just the kind of happy you feel in the front of your knees, but the kind of happy you feel in the back of your elbow. Oh, you'll never believe what's been happening. Yeah, yeah, I've already been briefed by the geriatric duo. Those two old coots sent me in to get updated with the Mermelair computer. What does that mean? Get updated with the Mermelair computer? Huh? Why would he have anything to do with but that? since you're here now, I'll let you do it. It's right over there. Oh, look at this place. I mean, police. Would it kill them to lay down a few throw rugs? And all this wasted space? How did those two old fogies make all this? Oh, that's easy. In episode 27, the Mermelair is invaded by the digging monsters of Bermuda, and that- Never mind! <laughs> oh, look at Stompy animation. That's cute. Okay, one thing that's very interesting to me is in the original game, you can't, this thing's here, but there, it is impossible to get here with Patrick. You cannot get here with Patrick, so it's like you can't see what this does. I'm really, wait, but there's a box here. Hmm, maybe that box wasn't there? I just know you can't get there with Patrick. I'm really curious how that works, because like if you look at that, oh, the springboard will like flat, splat you into the wall. But I think it actually, I think it just doesn't make any sense. It would just shoot you the correct way. You know, or not the correct way, but... Maybe one day I'll figure out what, which, which one does what there, but... Um, okay. <clears throat> the normal layer. I'm... This is one of the levels I'm not the biggest fan of. Uh, once again, I'm not the biggest fan of deep, dark dungeon level kind of thing. I'm much more of a bright colors kind of dude. I'm a baby that likes Nintendo games. What can I say? Hey! Stop! Stop! Oh, uh, what? I won't even hit me that. Stop! Stop! Uh, hit that, please. Okay, getting a little used to this. The bubble ball, the new bubble ball. Bubble ball, bubble ball, bubble ball, bubble ball, bubble ball, bubble ball, Okay, don't knock me off, please. Or if we meet again. For the last time. Uh, please. Please, green peas, please, please, green peas. Wait, you want to teleport? Now you are. <laughs> I never, like, it's so weird that he teleports using his hat. I don't get it. <laughs> There's nothing like Why does he teleport? He never really more. teleports to, like, Smells a significant like distance. He just moves, like, a few feet away. So, like, I don't even understand. Like, not only does it make no sense that he could teleport, like, there, like that, but also, like, what what's even the point? Because it doesn't really even change much of the battle. It's like, imagine if the hammers could teleport. It's like, 
it wouldn't really change anything about them. And I feel that way about these dudes too. It doesn't really change anything about them. So I don't know. I'm not really, I'm not complaining about it. I mean, it's just, it's weird. I don't understand. Did I get that purple? Oh my God. I should have died there. Thank God for Um. Okay, that's what I just came. Wait, what's this? I didn't hit this the first time? I guess I didn't see it. I just went directly. Oh, I got it. Nice. Bridge activated. So we're actually unlocking uh, stuff. Out of the so, so you see that floating platform there? That We just unlocked that. And also unlocked a wall. But let's go see what's going on over here. Hello, Mermaid Man. You're my hero. Hey, you're yellow. When did that happen? I don't know. And there's no reception because we're a thousand meters down into the ice. Um, we need Fresh, like a spring breeze. Oh, there's a bus stop. I feel like the bus stops kind of blend in with the lights in this game. They don't really stick out too well. It's not a they could play. It just it's kind of hard to see them sometimes. Wait, what's over there? What the heck is that? Ah, uh, that's interesting. Is that just? Well, I don't have anything like that in the other caves. Or in the, in the other part of the, why would that be? Why is that there? You can't go over there. Unless you can I've now. I got a job for somebody who can throw things. Oh, I can do that. Leave it to us. I'm great at throwing things. All you have to do is pick up a throw fruit and throw it into each of those funnel. Throw, throw the throw fruit, fruit. No, throw the throw fruit. Throw the tofu. You might want to be quick about it. I tend to explode. <laughs> I mean, they tend to explode. <laughs> I like that joke a lot. I tend to explode. It's very fitting for me to say that. Uh, what does this do? Does that lead over there? Oh, that leads to something else. Oh, no. Actually, this, this part of the game actually has a lot. Oh, this is going to be interesting. The physics here were really annoying before. Are you just gonna shoot to the right? All right. I tend to explode. I mean, they tend to explode. Also, those cannibals coming out of this tiny asshole. How would that happen? <laughs> uh, all right, this will be very interesting. Oh, it waits for you. This did not wait for you before. Oh God, so fast. Ah. And bamboozle. Right, let's go back to. I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. Right, let's try it again. Woo! Oh, there's one more. much better. Now I'm really curious about this. So that's, that's a nice update. Originally, like, ah, the pattern's always going on, and, like, regardless if you're on or not, it doesn't wait for you. I'm really curious about this one. This one always had a very weird physics. <laughs> okay, nice glitch, nice glitch, or invisible wall or something. The wall of the full foot. Uh. Um, hello? Why no respond? There we go. That took a long time. <gasps> oh, no! No! Oh no! Oh god, it's gonna take forever. I can't even do anything else in the meantime. We just gotta wait. I made the same stupid mistake. That I'm dumb. I'm so dumb. I'm so stupid. <laughs> okay, I don't know why. Like it's gone. I don't know why it took so long to respond for. Also, it like turns dark for some reason. What? Whoa! Did you see that? Like, no! Oh my god! The same button to throw it is the same button to ground pound. Oh my god, for <laughs> fuck's sake. Oh, uh, oh yeah. Um, I forget. <laughs> wow, that is a very relatable quote there, Patrick. I feel like I say that uh, way too consistently. Alright, touch ground first. Good, good. Throw it. Excellent. Wow. This feels a lot easier in this game once you actually don't be an idiot. I say it seems easy after I failed a bunch, but, I, you know, that was me being stupid all those times. It's wholly totally just gameful, haha. Huh? You did it! Now I can get some sleep. I like those fuzzy slippers. They're also massive. Oh, Absolutely oh, massive. Oh, oh. Yay! Yay! Hooray! Hooray! Um, okay. 
Oh no, I forgot what this was for a second, but now I totally remember. Wait, I can go over there using the, the bowling thing, can't I? A little cage uh, thing. I know you. You're that guy. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna need a lot more power to activate the hydroacoustic Doppler modulator. I think you're facing the wrong you way, Patrick. You think you can handle this? I could see Squidward's house from up here. And he's not wearing any pants. Oh wait, he never wears pants. Now listen up. There are eight cylinders over there. If you throw something at the cylinders, it'll turn around to the power side. Turn all eight cylinders around to the power side and I'll give you a reward. Sorry, what was that? I was watching Squidward. <laughs> Just start turning those cylinders. See, there's some really good... Uh... Oh, you can just hit that. Cool. Push, push, um, there's some really good writing in this game. I don't really care too much for the LL Random XD humor anymore, but some of this is very good. Okay, I'm very bad at this puzzle. So we're just gonna see what happens. So yeah, you hit a button and then the two, that like the three, change. I don't know. I just, just just give me a second, boys and girls, please. All right. This may look very obvious to you, Chris. You just gotta do this. But guess what? I'm too stupid. I'm too stupid. I'm too stupid. Okay. Foe the foe foot. Wait, did I get it? I got it! 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 Right? Wait, no, I didn't. Oops. Wait, maybe I did. Hold on, wait, wait. Let that explode, I guess. Come on, it's kind of a tell which way is the correct way. I did get it. I mean, I'm good at this puzzle. I'm amazing. I'm a genius. I'm so smart. Please hurt me now. They don't. They totally should though. Oh, bye to the boy. Ah, uh, well done. Now there's enough power. What do you need all that power for? Why, my foot bath, of course. Here, have a golden spatula. Golden spatula. <laughs> Thanks, BB. MMMBBB. All right, let's get on now. Get, get on, get on. Ow. 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 Get the socklets up there anymore that we already got. Um, okay. Where are the balls? Hold on. Wait a minute! Wait, I can't even get back over there, can I? Hmm. Wait, we need. Well, because we we'll will have to switch back to SpongeBob, but I don't want to watch the animation again, so we're just gonna go over here. So we're actually done here, I think. This is definitely like when I think of the Mermaid Layer, I think of this. <laughs> okay, don't know why that checkpoint activated. Uh, we're gonna let you throw. Oh, oh that's not where the Amy thing said you were gonna shoot at all! Please, please, oh. So I don't think we could actually deal with him without, with Patrick. Especially when there's no, uh, there's no throw fruit. Throw fruit. Where did that bus come from? Where did it go? Where did it come from? Cotton Eye Joe. Oh yeah, look, his eye's broken. That's Clarence. Or it's at least droopy. Um. Oh. I feel like a new sponge. Uh, oh, they got him. Nice. So when I said, like, left wall, right wall activated, is actually these are the walls I'm referencing. Whee. Well, that feels nicer in this game. Jumping up the walls. Jumping up the walls. Jumping up the walls. I just realized there's four areas in the Mermaid Lair, which is a lot more than usual. In order for me to regain control of the security system, you need to press all the override buttons spread throughout the Mermaid Lair. The first one is here. Press the buttons. Got it. When you have pressed them all, you should return here to press the master shutdown button. You will be. Reward. Return here. Are you Got listening it. to me? Listening. Got it. SpongeBob, we have such a good voice. Oh, it doesn't let you do it. Interesting. Uh, is there anything else here? Is there like a sock on top of this or something? I don't know what this was. In the original game, you could, if you actually position the camera just right, uh, you could actually see Mer or Barnacle Boys inside of here. Because they need like a character yeah, model for you, for you to be able to talk to, and they just do bark the boy, another bark boy in there. Oh, bark boy! And what is that? Oh, it's got a heart. Sorry, Karen. That's not actually Karen. Um. um oh, there's the box. 
Okay, look at this. Exactly. Okay, 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 okay. So, in order to get up here, you need to be SpongeBob in order to do... Because only SpongeBob has the wall jumping ability, right? And there's no... There's no, uh, there's no way, there's no bus thing up here. The bus thing's down there, right? So you can't jump up here with Patrick. So you jump in here, and this brings you to the beginning. So you still can't get back here as Patrick. Although, now in this game, you could actually teleport using the, um... Uh, you, you already can teleport and keep the character you're playing as. Wait. Wait, what? Oh. Oh! What's over there? Oh, just, is it just purple shiny objects? It totally is. Wow, but there's nothing else in here, huh? What's cool is here? This looks like something you'd see in Pitfall Lost Expedition. That's a reference no one will understand, but, um, you know, that little area looks like there will be a little shaman in there. Woo! Alright. Alright, let's go back here. Hello, Squidward. So, yeah, you still can't get here with Patrick, really, legitimately, anyways. And I think if you hit that platform, it'll just bring you back to, like, I think it brings you back to uh, where Mermaid Man is, I think. I'm not entirely sure, though. Um, Alright, I guess we'll end it here. I, I would much prefer to start the, the episodes when I'm, uh, you know, in the area, but, like, cutscenes play. I feel like those cutscenes are better suited for the beginning of episodes. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. I don't know why I read that. I wasn't going to read it aloud. And I'll talk to you guys next time. <gasps> hey, they added the, the, the rocks. all look like frogs in this game. Look, the, the two little barnacle things look like eyeballs. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Love you guys very much. Have a great day. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.